Now, this table identifies the AI tasks that people currently report as being most satisfied and least satisfied with the AI-generated result that they receive. Or to think about this another way, you can think about it like this. The stuff that people report as being most satisfied with what AI gives them, i.e. in the green box in the table, is likely to be the work where an AI most quickly displaces the humans performing those tasks today. So for example, that includes things like researching healthcare issues, researching laws, precedents, or other legal data, and unsurprisingly, editing and writing materials or documents. Now, in contrast, the stuff that people report as being least satisfied with what AI gives them in the red box is the stuff for which AI just isn't quite there yet, and where an AI is least likely to displace the human workers performing these tasks today. So, for example, evaluating the quality and accuracy of data, conferring with clients to determine their needs, creating visual designs or displays, and so on and so forth. So why is this relevant and important? Well, I share this with you because I think as we think about our own place in the world and this emerging post-AI economy, I believe data points like this can be helpful to determine where we should consider shifting our focus, both as entrepreneurs and the business opportunities that this presents, as well as professionals and the type of work that we decide to pursue.